visual numbers, the secret of math success or failure for 7, 8, 9 and 10 year olds. In a class of 5 year olds, the children nearly always say that they are good at maths and they like it. 8 year olds on the other hand say they often struggle. Why do so many 7 to 10 year old children decline in confidence and enthusiasm for maths? Well firstly, our written language is suited to sounds rather than quantities. Written words are clearly made up of sounds, but numbers contain no numerical information that you can see. You have to try to imagine or rely on memory. And calculations are even worse. If you have forgotten the answer, you're stuck. If you don't already know, the writing offers no real help. And so math classes separate into those who know and those who don't, when really it's supposed to be about working things out. Five-year-old maths always offers you the quantities to work with, and you stick to the same ten numbers until you are really familiar with them. But the older children tend to be pushed too quickly to symbol-based abstract math, with a confusing amount of different quantities, most of which are way too big to imagine. Surely we can give them a more inviting introduction to abstract maths. How about enabling children to actually see the real quantities they are working with. Here are 16 squares multiplied by 2. And we can see the two groups of 16 squares. And not just that they make up 32, but exactly how they do. And some of those children who have decided maths is not for them immediately perk up. Terence says, I can see halves. Mally says, I can see quarters. But not everybody can, so Mally says, try dividing by four. So we do. And now everybody can see quarters. Four equal parts on top of each other, says Clive. And even more of them start to switch back on. And then Isaac says, what about five? What happens if we divide it by five? So I say, I don't know. Why don't you try it? And they say, really? You don't know? I'll help you, says Helen. Thank you so much, I say. And she deletes the four and divides 32 by five. How much is that, I ask? The first colour group is six whole squares and nearly half, says Marianne. Six and just under a half. And Jenny says, and we didn't even need the equal sign. And everybody laughs and then we agree to press it anyway. 6.4 decimals, they declare. I want to see the decimal bits, says Cho. The children pair up and investigate how to show actual decimal bits. And Khan and Lucy show us this. 1 divided by 10. Tenths, says Amit. 0.1s, says Crystal. So now, if we highlight four of them, we can see 0.4, I say. I get it, says Charlotte. 0.4 is four of those 0.1s. So if we put in 0 0.4, it should be the same size, says Sarah. So we do. And we all see 0 0.4. And imagine it, or four lots of point ones. And I think to myself, we're going to be fine. In fact, we're going to do well. And if you give your children lots of visual numbers and visual calculations, so will they. Visual numbers and visual calculations. Visulator the Visual Calculator from Planet Brainy for iPad, iPhone and iPod Touch and for Android, smartphones and tablets. Visit planetbrainy.com and get our free downloads on the smartest, easiest and most effective ways you can help your children.